Hello everybody and welcome back to our second night of playing Nubia in the Around the World Playthrough Challenge. We got our start uh, started last night on our stream when we finished our Molly game. If you've missed anything from that, there should be some videos in YouTube for you to watch. And uh, p potentially the VOD on Twitch is still there as well if you want to watch it in its entirety in between the videos and all. But we got a pretty great start here with Nubia. Um... We've been able to expand up north and kind of push our borders up towards Australia. Interesting setup in this game. We're on continents, and we have four civilizations on this continent. We have Australia, we have Samaria, and we have India. And they're all kind of punching each other for space up here. Whereas we've got this wall of mountains kind of sealing us off from everybody else except for these openings here. There's several choke points like here, 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 and here. And then we've got all this land down to our southwest including Mount Rorema, and we have Mount Vesuvius there, and over here is Mount Kilimanjaro, which means Mount Everest is on the other continent with the other two civs that we haven't met yet. Of course, we're friends with Gilgamesh. He did get into an early fight with Australia. He lost his capital, and then he was able to uh, take it back by loyalty. So he kind of got uh, kicked in the teeth a bit and had a rough start. Australia has this big desert that I don't know what they're going to do with, and um, we've got plenty of land to settle here. Pretty soon we're going to start pushing our borders here against India, and then filling in back towards the south into the tundra around Mount Marema. Probably going to get a Petra City over here. And I'm going to try and grab Maui if I can. Let's see. Oh, I need a monument. So let's build our monument. Then I can do a devotion to Maui. Up here as well, I think I'm going to purchase this tile. So that Australia cannot claim any Vesuvius tiles. <laughs> Uh, that way it can be all mine. Uh, I don't know what to do with you. This scout has pretty much explored everything on this continent. We can see everything here. We just need to find the other continent, which is over here somewhere. Still don't see the land for it. It's, there's probably some land here because there's whales out here, unless it's just way out. Way out whales. But yeah, um, let's see here. We've got a governor title. And I'd really like to get owls, but we haven't found them yet. So I'm trying to think of what another option could be for our secret society. I think I'm going to promote Liang, so that way these tiles don't get damaged. We may lose resources, but if we make improvements, we won't lose those improvements. They won't get damaged. So that'll be very helpful. Let's adjust our cards as well. Uh, we're done fighting barbs, so that's good. Let's do... We do have a trade right out. Let's get some extra gold from that. And we should be good there. And we've got about five turns left in this era. We are in a golden age. We're going to go into a normal age for medieval. And we do have monumentality right now. So what I'll probably do is over the next few turns, I'll save my gold and buy some builders. Because that's probably all I can do. I can't faith buy or gold by a settler. But I can get a bunch of builders. And I'll probably try and get them up in the Liang city too. In fact, why don't we start? Oh, next turn. We'll get one next turn. Or maybe not next turn. We're only at 18 gold per turn. We could get you upgraded as well. We'll save that for next era for error score. But yeah, I'm pretty happy with how we're set up here. Hopefully we'll be able to settle ourselves in and not have to worry about people trying to forward settle us and try to sim away. I'm probably going to push for a science game if I can. I might not be able to buy this builder. We've got three turns to go. I might be, might be able to two on, the, two on the last turn of the air. We'll see. I'm getting one here. One just building it. Magic. Let's get Petra unlocked. We'll definitely want to get that going soon. And it's probably going to be in this city as well. Monument will be done next turn in the capital. Then we can devote to Maui. And Maui's pretty cool because he has a special ability that allows you to place... A unique tile, Im or not a tile improvement, a unique resource on an unowned tile that doesn't have one already. Which is pretty cool. You can see that's not going to work out for us. So let's do a devotion to Maui. It's only two turns. We are going to buy a builder up here that will give us four charges on it. We'll get another builder here next turn. And we'll go into a normal age. And that'll be just fine. We do need to get some more food in our capital. We'll probably chop the woods and put some farms around here. We do have our government plaza here as well. 
Dark Ages for them. Oh boy. We're gonna have some loyalty issues. Let's go get some more iron, shall we? And we'll definitely want to get walls up here. Down here... We've got Nazca, so I'm thinking of getting a builder if I can. But it's going to take too much production. At least for now. Let's just start working on walls. And that should be fine. Buildings in this district. Um, let's do the city center. And let's do ranged here. Perfect. We have Maui. Let's go make our Petra Desert amazing, shall we? We're going to get a builder in the capital to get some farms down. Got a builder here. I think I'm going to chop out another builder, too. So I can harvest this stone. Get a mine going. Got lots of iron in this game, which is nice. Lots and lots of iron. Let's go improve that for some extra gold. Oh, there's an existing resource here that I haven't discovered yet. Okay. You got Herc, unfortunately? I thought Herc was pretty cool. Sheep, okay. Get some extra food. Guess that's fair. Let's actually get our harbor tech unlocked because we will have some coastal cities here. Get a mine there. And we want to get a harbor here soon. Let's get another... Oh, you know what? We can make a devotion here. Um, who else would be good to devote to? Let's look at uh, Himiko... She's pretty cool, I think. She's a support unit for combat strength. She helps you get city-states. So I could do that for Wolin. And for Kumasi, I can get some free envoys in there. Let's, uh, let's grab her, shall we? Oh, it's going to be 11 turns? No, I might be able to chop that out if I harvest a stone here. That'll be fine. Uh, let's get you a water mill. I don't believe in it. Ooh, nice. Copper. Took out four turns. That's nice. Pretty sure... Yeah, all the profits are gone. Okay. So I'm not going to build a holy site. You know, this will probably just be a builder factory up here. Let's actually come down here to the capital and help them as well. We're going to have a builder in a couple turns, but I've got a lot of tiles to improve. It is not that life sure is distasteful. Oh, yeah, I did not get hurt. Yeah, that's true. That is unfortunate. Ooh, more copper. Yeah! Sweet. Get a mine here. Get a mine here. All right, I'm going to start working on another settler in the capital. I'm going to harvest that plot to get some food and put some farms down. I guess we could start building Petra now. And I think I'm going to do it here. That'll be a good spot. Alright, I guess I could bring these scouts home and just use them around in my territory for whatever. I don't really have another purpose for them right now. Probably chop that. A flat desert resource? Salt! Nice! That's very good for a Petra city. And for us. Maui is a lot of fun. I think we're out of charges. Yep, no charges left. Okay. 
Let's put you up here in case we need to have you attack or defend. All right, we got Himiko. Let's see if I can somehow get her up here. It'll take seven turns. That's fine, we got some roads. And let's work on the archer. Get some food. Wonderful. This city's gonna be doing just fine here. Hopefully we get some Vesuvius tiles soon. In fact, I think I'm gonna completely block him off now. No Vesuvius for you, Australia. It's all mine. Now, can Maui put any luxury resource on that tile or only ones that can populate on that kind of tile, i.e. desert? Um, I don't know, actually. I know it's specific to the continent he's on as far as luxuries go, but I don't know about um, if it changes depending on, like, the terrain type. It might. I think they just make it to where if it can generate there, then he can place it, basically. Uh, Sue's Johannesburg. I got Johannesburg's up at the top here. Nice. Yeah, based on the train. Okay, that makes sense. He's coming around this way. Let's uh, establish a choke point. <laughs> you can hang out there. Guess it would be good to get some more archers just in case. All right, also, we can almost get you upgraded. No, you're fine. Don't worry about it. Let's make a devotion down. Oh, gosh. We need... Uh, you know what? Let's just have you work on a builder. But when I can, I'll probably buy a tile for them. Nice. All right, we got plenty of food here in the capital now. Plenty of food. We're going to chop to produce more builders with extra charges. be able to embark and discover the other continent. Choke point established. <laughs> you cannot pass unless you can swim. Nice. More builders, more builders. Ah, here we go. We'll be able to seize them here pretty quick. Get some air score for it. That's two. I just need one more. Thankfully, she can do that quite a bit. All right. We need to come settle this way. So let's do that. In fact, I may just come settle right here to make a point of it. Now I can get our harbor. Nice plus four harbor. We also need to get your aqueduct going. Let's do that after we finish this builder. Nice, we discovered Hippolyta. Very nice. And then we need to go do the same to Kamasi if we can. Get some more envoys there. Although, it's actually been claimed by Gandhi, so maybe we won't. Maybe we'll go reinforce our suzerains at uh, Johannesburg. That would be fine as well. Yeah, doing Maui on Tundra Tiles. We'll probably faith by him later once he's dead, and we'll do some Tundra Tiles resurrect him. Let's get a dam because we're probably going to want to build a dam in the capital. We've got some floodplains there. All right, let's get ancient walls going there. Let's 
take you up there. I'd like to claim some of this land. <laughs> take it away from the other guys just to be a little mean. Cause that's how you play the game. You gotta be a little aggressive sometimes. Alright, time to go spread these builders around. This is literally a builder factory, but first we get our aqueduct going. And let's get up to exploration, shall we? Although we do have some governor titles we can claim here. Wouldn't be a bad idea. Now I have all the Vesuvius tiles unlocked. We should probably get some districts going here. Thinking of doing a commercial hub here. Oh, he got blocked out by Australia. Let's be friends with Gilgamesh because he is our bro. Hold on, hold on. We can make this work. It's got to be two. Cool. Gandhi wants to be friends, too. We're going to be friendly people, yeah? <laughs> they want to be friends with me. Yay! I have friends. 34 gold. Wow, thank you. So generous. Oh, it's because I'm already suzerain of them. Never mind. Okay. So I can actually bring her back then until I find another city-state. Or I can just keep working on Kamasi. That'd be fine. Gilgamesh eat hot sauce. Gilgamesh eat hot sauce. Yep. <laughs> Whenever he says it, it sounds like he's saying Gilgamesh eat hot sauce. It's funny. Go put some uh, improved tiles in Nuri. The city's gonna explode with population now once we've got the aqueduct done. The poets have been mysteriously silent. I think we're gonna put down this plus four harbor first. And put down a Nubian pyramid. <coughs> Monument. Oh, he came and settled! <laughs> Look at that! I really hope that city will loyalty flip. We settled the same turn! Oh, he played me! Oh, that's funny, though. That That's really funny. could declare on him and just take it if I wanted to. Because then I can control both choke points. Although we're friends right now, so I can't. Gosh, dang it. Shouldn't have become friends with him. Oh, hell. Um, let's get more builders going. Oh, there's some Vesuvius. Oh, we got some culture. Yeah. Like to see that. I've lived through some Wow, look how violent it is. Oh, and he's trying to come in with a settler now? Where are you gonna go, sir? You have nowhere to go. In fact, I'm going to make it a little bit difficult for you. Alright, now 
now let's get up to exploration. Get our next tier of government. Let's do this. We'll get some more great merchant points once our commercial hub is done. Um, let's possibly do some policy changes here. Extra charges on builders will be good because this build will be done in a few turns. You had both of them settling in there? Yeah, I thankfully was able to move in, so I only, I've only gotten one, but he's not going to be able to settle in this way. I think he knows that, hopefully. He has nowhere to go that where he'll be able to keep the city. Guess I gotta put Maui here and block the tile. Get a market going. Scary that he does have crossbows though. Guess we can get that tech here pretty soon. He's probably mad that I took all the Vesuvius tiles. <laughs> discover niter so we might have some in the desert down here oh, I've got some gold to spend on builders oh there's an island here barbarian island builders 390 holy crap no we don't have any gold to buy a builder with where he's gonna go. Oh, that hurt you a bit. I just wanna get that salt. Get some more envoys there. Because why not? trader going. Get your granary. <clears throat> Excuse me. Get another trader. Nice. Three traders, huh? Alright, let's get another settler going. Sweet. Got a nice little Petra there now. Oops. These tiles are going to be very nice. Susan of Kamasi. Sweet. Ooh, I can accept that. I thought it was a myth. <laughs> he's trying to come around and I think he's going to come settle this way, but I don't think it's going to work well for him. He's not going to be able to keep that city. Ooh, are we going to go into a dark age here? Hmm. Gold trade route here to Nazca. Free envoy. Lovely. Should build our first horse. We got faith for that. Interesting. This is a six-player map, so there's two more civilizations somewhere. Let's do... We've got lots of silk. And culture bombs for me, of course. 
I've got so much favor now because I sued all these city-states. Maui is gone. How long until I can faith buy him back? It's a thousand faith. Okay, so I gotta save up for that. Oh, you are going to die, unfortunately. No more charges left. Okay, let's just bring you back then. Let's get a nice culture mine there. Got another trader. Guess that means I stopped producing this one yet. Now I know there's an island over there, though. Australia, why don't you go settle the island in, instead of settling near me? Just makes more sense. But I guess the AI isn't really logical, are they? No, that's not gonna happen. No. Yeah, he's gonna come settle this way. Weird. Wolin's kind of in a cool spot. You need me to search for a nighter so you can know where it is? Is that how this challenge works? I show you how to play the game? <laughs> you can figure that one out on your own, can't you? I do not think that's how you play the game. Oh, we're going to get Petra this era. Nice. Three turns. cheating <laughs> I don't care if you're ahead of me <laughs> you just have you not discovered Niter yet is that the deal finally got a builder wow gotta get some production going here Let's do Sun Wukong. He's a fun scout. And maybe I can get him to cross the ocean soon. All but blisters. Alright, since I made a promise with Indy, I can't settle here right now. But I could settle down this way or over there. I think that way might be good because it pushes up more against Australia. Get an archer here. Alright, I think it's time to claim a secret society. I don't think we're gonna... We, we've done a lot of envoys here, and we haven't met owls yet. So the chances of us meeting owls are gonna be a little slim. So I'm thinking of going... Hmm, actually I don't know. We don't have much of a faith economy right now, but that hasn't stopped us in the past. Plus, it'll increase as our monuments turn into um, old god obelisks. No, this isn't multiplayer cannon bait. <laughs> this is uh, this is single player, but he's playing along. And uh, you guys can grab the game settings from Discord if you want to play this exact same map along with me. What would you guys say? Should we do Void Singers or Hermetic Order? Hermetic Order is going to give us ley lines and help us with signs. Void Singers is going to give us faith and boost our yields from cities. What do you think would be good? I'm interested to know your guys' opinions. I've already got both of these governors to where I want them to be. I think it's about time we adopt a secret society. I think having a faith economy could be nice. The placement of ley lines could be a little sketchy, iffy. Don't know where they'd be. I'd hate it if I accidentally settled or put a district on top of them. <laughs> Adopt a secret society today for just 14 cents a day. <laughs> you too can adopt a secret society. Don't go to a society mill. Adopt. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Puppy mills. This episode's finishing. We need to pick. Um, I think I'm going to go Void Singers. That's 
going to give us a lot of faith. And there's the episode. Perfect timing. Okay. Well, uh, that is the end of this episode for YouTube. If you guys are enjoying, be sure to click the like button and comment to let me know how your games are going. Uh, if you're new to the challenge, click on the links below where you can get the challenge checklist. And join us in Discord where you can grab the game settings, the map keys, everything you need to play along with us. And uh, you can share your screenshots and tell us how you're doing. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode.